need an entrance like that? I'll answer for you. Nope. Hey guys, what's up? Today we'll be we'll I'll be showing you all the mistakes that you might have not seen in Jurassic Park. So uh um uh, I'll show you the clips from them and I'll try to move back to me to explain them I'll kind of voice over them as well so you try and spot them as well because hope I hope all my fans are familiar with the Jurassic franchise I did have just put a replay filter on that but better do it handmade Uh, don't know. So, guys, today I'm gonna put you to the first uh, mistake clip. <laughs> Stupid today. Oh, ow. Anyway, um, yeah. So I'm gonna. Hmm. I've heard that before. So enjoy the clips, and I'll be right back. They're hiding from the T-Rex behind the car, and the car shoves Alan and Lex onto the side of the paddock, as Alan Grant nearly falls off the edge of it. Wait, what? Where did that come from? Did the directors not think that where did the Tyrannosaurus Rex come from in the paddock? I thought Steven Spielberg was meant to be a genius. And I checked, and I, I looked all around, and I still, and I didn't, just to cover my uh, point, I didn't see any, like, flat, like, it would make a teensy bit more sense if there was, like, flat land and then a big drop, which is kind of weird, but anyway, that would make a bit more sense, but when I checked, there wasn't. Just quickly, um, this mistake, if you didn't really uh, know what this was, uh, this mistake I was talking about, n n not many of you might find this as a mistake, but I, I thought, how did the T-Rex know that the power was out? But, you know, you can correct me in the comments if you want, but I was just, that was just a personal mistake to me, honestly. I was just wondering how she knew, like, she just, like, Neji turns it off and she just knows it it's out yeah just i just thought but you know you can tell me why in the comments if you want <laughs> i mean i only started watching these films like two years ago so three years ago actually i forgot it's 2024 oh by the way before i go back to the scene happy new year Does he think he's going? When you gotta go, you gotta go.
if you guys didn't see it, that's alright. I didn't see it on the first 17 times. <laughs> but, um, I'll replay it again. And it is a, it is a mistake. Um, it's kind of not noticeable. Like, it's really hidden. But I spotted it the last 17 times. So, uh, I'll replay it now. Before I do replay the scene, I hope you don't mind, but sometimes I forget what I'm, uh, what I need to say. You can see there is a string pulling the car. Warning. Um. If you've never watched these uh, films and you're just watching my video because you love me, um, uh, this one kind of, um, if you don't like seeing people get eaten, I'm pretty sure you should skip this one. Um, and also, um, the people who do watch it and the people who have watched it, um, this one is about Donald Gennaro, the funny man that got eaten off the toilet. So... Oh yeah, right, forgot what I was saying. See? Um I just completely empty. Mm. Oh yeah, okay. Um Um like correct me on this one please, but um I seem to notice that everything when the Tyrannosaurus Rex is running up with um chasing Ian, Ian falls and nearly gets killed. Um and the Rexy Rex, he, um, stays there, and he just, then, if, uh, uh, then he knocks the toilet down, everything except, the, knocks the bathroom down, everything except the toilet with D Donald Gennaro in. Probably because that was the only hard thing in it, but I think when we see him running in, I think I see a sink in there, which is kind of a mistake if you think about it, because a sink is hard as a toilet, honestly, it's the same kind of fabric. So, it's funny how it, the only thing that didn't fall was the one he, uh, was the only thing that he was sat on. I'll replay him running in, and let's see if there's actually a sink in sight. Why, I mean, why wouldn't there be? Well, just wash your hands in the mud? Oh, there was a toilet. Wasn't expecting that. Anyway. I thought it was so small that it could only fit one toilet, but then uh, I thought it, 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 I think it could fit like five or three, four, anyway. And when it knocks down, I don't see toilets around him. Floor. Don't know how they were on the floor though. It didn't knock him down. It didn't knock that toilet that you sat on down. But we'll we'll find out in the next uh, video. But um, it's not done yet. We've got one more mistake. And before I go, I'm so sorry, Steven Spielberg. I don't know what's come over me. I thought that you made a mistake with the toilets, but turns out they just fell. Stupid. Just, just mm, bonkers. Okay guys, uh, we've got one more mistake and then we'll have to end this video there. Okay, this was kind of the biggest mistake they made. As you can see, with that scene, you can actually see that Timmy can fit in it. He can. He could have just gone straight through if he had a bit of help. I mean, obviously Alan and Lex couldn't have gone back up because... The gate was on, but he could have climbed right, right through. He didn't have to go all the way over the top. So, don't know. Sadly, guys, I'm going to have to end this video here. We have seen a lot of good mistakes spotted in Jurassic Park, but still is one of my most favourite films ever. And make sure to hit the subscribe button and also like. 
for net for more videos and hit the notification bell. Anyway, that's all for me. Anyway, catch you later on Noah's Jurassic Unboxing.